The learning is scaffolded. First I have the overview and I find out how to control two characters and that I can toggle between them and then I learn to move each one. More actions are layered on top of this until I build up my ability to direct the character and make choices. The game uses symbols, text, and animation to show me how to move or to use the controller. Here red highlights show me what I need to do and a small white dot can focus my attention on objects that I can interact with. Every move I learn is completely immersed within the narrative so that what I learn to do makes sense within the story and as I learn to fight the scene fades a bit indicating that I can take action. Each move was introduced and then I did it and if I didn't get it right the scene repeated. Cutscenes seamlessly transitioned in and out of gameplay. For example, I was driving the motorcycle and then the camera began to pan to the actor's face and then I crashed and lost control of the character. The game is a bit difficult for me. It's going to take me a while to remember how the controller is mapped. Plus, running and driving are hard for me. I often swerve and fall off of things like in this game where I've fallen off countless times these logs as I was trying to run to the top. Also, the intensity of the story will likely make me forget that I have agency and that I can act.